questions about that. Not only Columbus Day, these other holidays that it's not us. We're indigenous people. We have to come united as one people. The prophecy of the Condor and Eagle has come to pass. The northern people and the southern people are coming in together, all colors, all sizes, all ages. So it's up to you and all your little kids for you to raise your kids with consciousness. Consciousness of what they see, what they teach them in the school, what they're brainwashing them to think and to say. So it's hard, it's, it's a hard, it's really hard for men and women to teach the, the old ways to your kids. But it's up to you for these ways not to die. It has to live within me, within my nieces, within all of you. So I, I take this time to tell you, you know, be conscious of what you see, what you hear. Don't believe all the hype, all the media, the radio. Look for the truth within yourselves. Read books, not the books that they give us at school, because I grew up in, in, in the LAUSD. It's all bullshit. Nobody tells me about the Spaniards, why they ki kill my people, the Incas, the Quechuas, the Aymaras, the Guarani. So I had to find myself, and I had to look for my own truth. And the same thing goes with every one of you guys, and your kids, and your grandkids, and the babies to come into the new generation, the new seeds. It's for us to teach them enlightenment. Go back the old ways, our ancestors' way. That's the only way we're going to survive. The Wasichu wants us to be confused, to get in uh, drinking uh, fire water, alcohol, drugs. You got to understand that. That is not our ways. It was never our ways. The Europeans brought that in. Our ways is Pachamama, Mother Earth, we have to take care of her. If we want to live, and we want our new generations to live in this beautiful land, it's up to us to take care of it now and fight for it, even if it takes your life. So I'll just say, give you a little conscious. You know, my people from the South, we had runners called Chaskis. They used to come from Mexico, all the way to Bolivia, to Central America. We all want people. But we need to stop the fucking thinking, excuse me my language, that we're black, we're Asian, we're Europeans, we're this and that. We're all one, if we just, one cause. So I say, one heart, one drum, one enlightenment. We all be sure free. We still slaved mentality. We still have that slave mentality. You know, we still raise our kids, oh, you know, it's okay to, Go to Dodgers game, you know. But what are we doing for our communities? What are we doing? Nothing. We just go Friday nights, get high, go party, go sleep with some women. Us women are the life givers. It's up to us to raise our men as good warriors, good men, to stop beating our women. This month is October. It's purple. It's for domestic violence. How many are of indigenous women are murdered and killed? Too many. They don't have no faces, but now we have names. As a survivor of domestic violence, I say, please, our warriors, stop beating our women. Love them. Take care of us. Oh. Nurture us. Be our true warriors like our ancestors were. Stop beating us. A real man beats a drum, not a woman. A home. Oh, thank you.